For over 36 years, Rockwood has grown to become a name synonymous with camping and the great outdoors. Let's see how easy it is to set up your new Rockwood camping trailer. Once you have selected your campsite, make sure you position your camping trailer on level ground. Before starting the setup procedure, be sure that the battery is properly connected to power the unit if you plan on operating the optional power tongue jack. Setup begins with cranking the dolly jack to level the camper. If your camper is equipped with the optional power tongue jack, simply push the switch to the extend position on the power tongue jack to raise the front of the camper and to the retract position to lower the camper. Next, set the stabilizer jacks with sand pads on all four corners of the camper. Simply crank down each jack to stabilize the camper. After all stabilizers are set, release the two latches that hold the roof secure. Now, lift the handle on the left roof section with a smooth, firm action to raise both roof sections. Lift until the left roof section locks securely into the groove at the top of the right roof section. Open the lower section of the door. Enter into the camper while opening and holding the upper section of the door. Close the lower door section. At this time, refer to the optional A-frame awning screen room setup menu selection if you purchased this option. Raise the door sidewall by lifting at the top of the upper door opening continuing to hold the upper door section open until the wall is upright. While applying outward pressure on the wall directly below, secure the left side latch at the top of the wall into the plate mounted on the ceiling. Lift to set the off door sidewall until upright. Secure both the latches as done previously. Then secure the other door side latch using the same procedure. Attach the door sections by securing the latch mounted to the lower door section to the catch mounted to the upper section. Remove the dinette cushions from the bed position and place the table on its side or on the bed. Then simply unfold the table legs and lock into place. In most models, Rockwood uses a freestanding table so it can be utilized both inside and outside the camper. If your model has a floor-mounted table base, install the pedestal legs into the floor pedestal and set the table into place. Next, position the seat cushions and supported back cushions on the bases. Most Rockwood models feature the fantastic vent. This 12-volt, three-speed fan is quiet, dissipates condensation, and exchanges the air in your tent camper, allowing you to breathe natural, ambient outside air. It's important to always secure the vent cover with the lock on the inside before closing for travel. If you have the model A122, your Rockwood has been equipped with standard heated mattresses that generate a warm, gentle, soothing heat for those chilly nights. To provide power to your heated mattresses, Simply plug in the power cord and controller into the outlet zone into the side of the mattress and plug into a 110 volt outlet located on the walls near the bed ends. Since the appliances in your Rockwood camper may vary according to floor plans and options, we suggest that you consult your dealer and or owner's manuals included with your camper for operating and maintenance information. To attach the outside grill, Remove it from the box and assemble according to the manufacturer's instructions. Begin by installing the grill base onto the mounted bracket located on the side of the camper. Place the grill on the base and attach the LP gas line provided from the opening on the side of the camper to the grill. Remove the grill before closing up the camper. At this point, your Rockwood hard side camping trailer is ready to use. The Rockwood hard side camping trailer must be in the closed position to tow. At this time, refer to the optional A-frame awning screen room setup menu selection for disassembly instructions. Once you're ready to begin closing the camper, start with disconnecting the door sections by releasing the latch mounted to the lower door section from the catch mounted to the upper section. Next, release the latch on the right at the top of the door sidewall from the plate mounted on the ceiling, 
then release the two latches at the top of the off-door sidewall from the plates mounted on the ceiling. Lower the off-door sidewall until down flat. Now, release the latch on the left at the top of the door sidewall from the plates mounted on the ceiling. With the upper section of the door open, step into the door opening of the wall. While holding the upper section of the door, lower the door sidewall gently until down flat. Open the lower door section and exit the camper. Close the upper section of the door and then close the lower section. Lift the handle on the right roof section up with firm action, holding it up until the left roof section disengages from the groove on the right roof section. Now, fasten the safety latches on both sides of the top roof section and raise the four stabilizer jacks up to the closed position. The camper is now ready to hook up to your tow vehicle. Rockwood has combined Amish craftsmanship and over 36 years of experience to build you a camper of exceptional quality and value. Thank you for choosing Rockwood.